NASA has announced that it selected Boeing to lead a campaign for a full-scale transonic truss-based wing demonstrator. This is a campaign that will involve the development, but also flight testing of such an aircraft. In January 2019, Boeing unveiled their lightweight, ultra-thin, yet also more aerodynamic wing concept to the world. Research indicated that it would fly higher, yet also faster than the previous concepts released. Now, I would love to show you beautiful graphics of the plane for the duration of this video, but the reality is we only have one or two renders of what it will actually look like, so please do bear with me on this one. From one end to another, the folding wing design would measure 170 feet, with the wingspan being made possible thanks to the pressure of a truss. It supports the extended wing, which is also, Boeing wants to reiterate this, ultra thin. For nearly a decade, Boeing and NASA have been studying the concept as part of a subsonic ultra green aircraft research, SUGAR program. The research focuses on innovative concepts that reduce noise and emissions while enhancing performance. Performance. This is a direct quote coming from Boeing. Yesterday's announcement highlights the commitment though towards sustainable aviation and aircraft manufacturers truly looking at what is next and how their aircraft may look in the coming decades. The announcement though also presents an opportunity to design, build and fly a full scale experimental plane which should allow for the solving of technical problems that may be associated if there are any that do actually emerge at the end of the day. NASA's SFD, Space Act Agreement, funding is reported to total USD $425 million. At the same time, Boeing and its partners will fund USD $725 million to shape the program and acquire the necessary resources to really move forward with it. Boeing's previous investments, though, in recent phases of this program also total USD $110 million. That means the total is well over the one billion mark thus far. After more than a decade of development, this airframe concept is the result, and it's undergone thorough digital but also wind testing in the tunnel to advance the truss brace wing design as much as possible, make it as robust and feasible for an eventual full-scale demonstrator. The full-scale demonstrator, according to the air current, will fly in 2028. However, several major tests must take place before naturally it can do such a thing. How these pan out do remain to be seen, but full focus will be put on the representatives at the program and their partners, as they hope to achieve milestones promptly on the design to reach that eventual target, which is now only five years away. While some have labelled this as a potential replacement for the now tired 737 series, others remain more sceptical that this will even fly. You could say the sector is at a little bit of a crossroads. However, at its very core, one can be thrilled with such innovation of an aircraft and taking a look at really what the future may be. I'd be interested to hear from you though. What are your thoughts on such a design and of course the announcement that NASA has selected Boeing and its partners? While many believe it was only going to ever go one way and that would be Boeing would win such a campaign, it'll be interesting to closely follow this over the next five years to see how the development and testing truly goes. You can leave your thoughts on the design and anything else related to this aircraft down below in the comments. Thank you very much for your support, take care and be safe, and I'll see you later for more content on the aviation industry.